Hi, I'm Dr. Rasya Dikshit. I'm a practicing dermatologist who has been in private practice in Bangalore from the last 15 years. In a lifestyle which is very hectic, commutes which are taking more than 2 to 3 hours, with long work days of 12 to 14 hours, a lot of patients are resorting to fat diets to lose their weight. But when you use any fat diet, maybe the keto diet, the GM diet or the paleo diet, what you're compromising on is your skin and hair health. Because any fat diet work on this principle that you're trying to fool the body to think that it is in a starvation, whether it's intermittent fasting. We are trying to tell the body that it is in a state of starvation and in this state, the calories are burned from the fat as opposed to being burned by any other source. So when this is happening, the skin and the hair are compromised because the body does not prioritize the metabolism in these areas and the skin starts to look dull, aged, wrinkly and you know a lot of patients after losing weight of many kilos come to us looking tired and they say you know I'm not having the old charm anymore and this is because they've lost weight in the unhealthy way. A better way is to eat healthy and exercise regularly and get a small calorie deficit in your diet. It's a better way of doing a diet or a weight loss than just going for a crash diet. The advice that I would give for such people who are starting a healthy diet along with the exercise regimen is to focus on foods which are great for the skin and they are great for your diet too. First thing is to use omega-3 fatty acid rich foods like walnuts, flax seeds, fish, salmon in your diet. This is going to make sure that the skin's integrity, which is your lipid layer, is not getting damaged so your skin does not lose its luster or charm. The second is to make sure you've got a good protein content and this protein could be in a vegetarian derived from sprouts, broccoli, paneer or even uh, your tofu, soya variants or dals and in a non-veg obviously you have a much bigger range ranging from eggs and uh, you could also think of your lean meats like chicken and fish to make sure that your protein is intact. When you eat these foods, your hair fall is reduced. And the third thing which you have to make sure you're taking is an antioxidant rich meal. So your antioxidants, bioflavonoids, carotenoids, they are all contributing to stopping pigmentation and premature aging of the skin. They're making sure your skin retains its even color, it's not prone for early wrinkles. So the most important bit is the third bit which is your antioxidant rich fit foods which has uh, lycopenes, bioflavonoids, carotenoids which are going to prevent any pigmentation on your skin. They are going to prevent aging of your skin and this set of foods is basically your vegetables and fruits. So the brighter the fruit, the brighter the vegetable, the more antioxidant it has. So make sure you have at least 3-4 colors on your plate like you could choose from red capsicum, you could choose from pomegranates, you could choose beetroots, carrots. And these are all the foods which are going to give you the boost of immunity, the boost of antioxidants and what you need the most which is the anti-aging treatment when you are doing a diet.